So we were going to be shooting a sketch today for the horse's neck, and Mike wanted to ride a horse. He didn't tell me he hadn't done it before. Let's see how he's doing. How you doing there, Mike? Fine. You got a uh, bum ankle, a jacked up shoulder, a wrecked wrist, and a little whiplash. Broke your glasses. You're enjoying this. Say hi to your mom. Let her know you're okay. Hi, mom. Okay, that's enough. Okay. Let's just show him how to make the drink. Okay. Today on Drinks Made Easy, we're making a great three ingredient cocktail that's had a lot of different variations over time. One even without alcohol. But this is the most common modern version using bourbon, ginger ale, and bitters. And it's called the horse's neck. Today I'm going to be using bourbon from my friends over at Smooth Ambler in West Virginia. It is a fantastic bourbon. They've got a bunch of great products, so I recommend checking them out. You'll start by adding two ounces of bourbon into a Collins glass full of ice. Top it off with ginger ale. And add bitters to taste. I like about five dashes. Some like more, some like less. Give it a little stir, and there you have it. The horse's neck. Mm. How you doing there, Mike? Pretty good. Hey, where's the garnish? Uh, this one doesn't really use garnishes anymore because originally it was with brandy and now that's with whiskey It's more heavy on the Angostura. So for the most part people don't really do the garnish anymore. Oh, yeah. oh Should I be drinking this on pain meds? Uh, probably not a good idea. Mm. I'm gonna take a nap. Yeah, why don't you go lay down? Mm. Dumbass. Huh? I said uh, always remember to drink responsibly and don't ride horses if you don't know how to.